assalamu alaikum in this video we are going to talk about how to set up vmware and ubuntu on windows operating system Ubuntu works on different platforms like uh, linux windows uh, and also other operating systems but uh, the recommended operating system is uh, linux most of the developers uh, uses linux uh, ubuntu debian uh, series uh, the uh, one other reason uh, for uh, ubuntu is that um, there is a lot of support available for ubuntu you can find a lot of uh, help uh, for uh, os level issues if you are using windows operating system and you want to stick uh, with windows you have two options either uh, install udo on windows uh, directly or use a virtual machine to install ubuntu on virtual machine so you will be able to do the development uh, using ubuntu but for this purpose you should have a powerful machine like for example uh, your ram minimum should be 8 uh, gb ram so that you can uh, allot 4 gb ram to a virtual machine and uh, the rest of the 4 uh, gb ram uh, can be used for the uh, by the core operating unit operating system so in this video we are going to uh, set up uh, vmware on windows uh, and then we will install uh, Ubuntu 20.04 uh, on virtual machine. In order to download VMware, uh, go to vmware.www.vmware.com. Here you can see the download uh, menu. Then go to free product download and uh, click uh, workstation tier workstation tier is a, a software which can help us to run uh, both and uh, windows click uh, download no button to download workstation tier for windows as i have already downloaded uh, uh, a workstation tier 15.5 so i will uh, directly try to install workstation tier so vm uh, we are now clear uh, download is complete now click uh, the downloaded uh, software and install it you can uh, install it same as uh, we install other windows application click next and uh, it will uh, and follow the information i have already installed it so i will not repeat this process so let's uh, so let's cancel it and uh, i know uh, again uh, try to download uh, ubuntu uh, for this purpose uh, go to ubuntu.com uh, here you can see the download option uh, click uh, the download option uh, you will see ubuntu desktop and ubuntu server uh, for our development purposes we are uh, going to use um, ubuntu desktop uh, which is a bit uh, user friendly uh, for um, new user so just click here to download ubuntu i have already downloaded it and i will uh, directly start installation of ubuntu on virtual machine i am going to open vmware machine so this is the screen of the vmware machine so click create new virtual machine and then uh, click uh, installer disk image as i have already downloaded ubuntu um 20.0 desktop uh, version so and it is uh, located inside this uh, 
uh, disk so uh, it uh, directly picks this location so click next and uh, here uh, i will give information like i want to uh, 20.04 username is ubuntu and password is uh, this is private so click next and uh, in here you can uh, give a name something like ubuntu 20.04 and uh, this is the location where Ubuntu files will be located so click next and uh, so here uh, we have to allot uh, hard drive for um, the minimum recommended uh, hard is uh, 20 GB but I would uh, recommend to uh, allot uh, around about 40 GB if if your system have uh, more uh, memory then you can assign more than 40 also but 40 is minimum for this purpose select this second option split uh, virtual disk into multiple and click next uh, here all the information are here so like name is ubuntu workstation 15 point uh, operating system is ubuntu 16 64 bit and hard disk is 40 uh, gb memory is uh, 2 mb so ram is um, uh, uh, 2 gb which is uh, less in this case so i will uh, uh, my my system has uh, 16 gb ram so i am going to allot 8 gb ram to this uh, virtual machine so this operating system so that uh, I have uh, I uh, it should not stuck anywhere and then uh, click finish so the installation uh, will start uh, from here and it will take uh, a bit of time so uh, when to install on a virtual machine we are going to start it uh, like here and click play virtual machine So uh, the startup depends on the specification of your uh, machine. So after clicking the play virtual machine, you uh, have to enter the password that uh, we have set up before. And after that, uh, Ubuntu uh, is running. So in the next video, we will uh, install and set up uh, PyCharm and also python 3.7 so uh, thank you for watching this video and uh, also subscribe our channel and click the bell icon to get our timely updates